Nah, this just took a whole turn. Whoa, breaking... Break the fucking computer! So, I don't know if you guys remember the game, The Shopping List. Hey, what are you doing out here in the pouring rain at this time? I could take you where you're headed. Just get in the car and I'll take you wherever. I could do with some company. Oh, nah, I, I could choose to accept or not? Very, very good game. Turns out that the creator has released a new game called Broken Through. And seven years ago, your best friend Leo Williams mysteriously disappeared and no one had the slightest clue where he went. Seven years after this incident, Leo was declared dead since no one could find him. And now you are in possession of his belongings. But something about his stuff seems off. Something says he's still out there. And many more too. That's a fire concept already. I already love it. All right, Broken Through. Ava Williams' son, Leo Williams, went missing. Countless investigations and countless searches took place, but no glimpse of where he went. Seven years after this incident, Ava Williams got a letter saying that Leo Williams was declared legally dead, since they would never found any evidence as to where he went or where he is now. Well, that should be everything. Thank you for stopping by. I know Leo would have wanted you to have some of his stuff, knowing how close you two were. But anyways, I guess I'll head back inside now. Drive safe, okay? Alright, take care. Bye-bye. Let's get all these boxes on the truck. Damn, that's a lot of boxes. Let's get our friend's boxes on the truck. That's honestly so sad. Your friend just goes missing and like there's no evidence of anything happening. And now seven years later, you're just given some of his stuff. Get in the car. Broken. Through. <laughs> okay. Created by Jordan Lindgren. W-A- No way, I'm driving. Oh my god, they made a huge mistake. I'm feeling them midnight munchies. I'll stop by 11-7 and get a bag of chips before driving home. Ah uh, yes, 11-7, the clearly superior version of 7-Eleven. They have free Slurpees every day at 11-7. Skrrr! Skrrr! Nice. I'm staying on the right side of the road, we're chilling. Don't worry, guys. I'm, I'm following the law. You know, I'm a driver myself in the real world, and uh, I'm a pretty good driver, you know. The only accidents I've ever gotten into is when my car has been parked. 11-7. Yes. Ah, see? Look at my perfect parking. Here we are. Alright. Hello, sir. Objective, get some snacks. Um, I definitely want a snack of some cheddar cheese. Or not. How about some crushed tomatoes? Or mushroom soup? Alright, game. Just judge me for my snack selection, why don't you? Ooh, we have Doritos Nacho Grease Chips. We have Doritos Cool Stank Chips. We have Cheetos. Or we have Lazy's Chips. Damn, I mean, I love toes, so I'll take any of these. Definitely give me them cheese toes. Hell yeah. And we got fruity. Slushy machine covered in ketchup. Slushy machine. All right. Why is it covered in ketchup? Hello, sir. Hey, I'm just getting these chips. All right. Let's see here. That'll be $2. But hold it. Do you really want to buy that bag of chips? It barely has any chips. Just air. Um, yeah. Maybe I could interest you in buying my own brand that I'm working on. Jordan's Jolly Jipper. 0% air, 100% chips. I even made a commercial for it. I don't think I'm interested, sorry. Do you want to see the commercial? Maybe it'll help change your mind. <laughs> There's no way I'm saying no. Right now, we're 2 dollars 
What the fuck? <laughs> Please buy it. I'm definitely interested after seeing that ad. I gotta try them for myself. Thank you! I'll give it to you for a dollar. Special friend price. But anyway, it's three dollars for the two bags of chips. I'm not giving him a tip, are you kidding? Nah, actually, I got I get it I gotta I gotta support my fellow creatives, you know what I mean? He's making his own brand of chips. I gotta I gotta respect it. I gotta respect it. Thank you! I knew I was a good businessman. Anyway, have a good day. Um, bye. I can't wait to eat some Jordan Jolly Jipper when I get in the car. And my cheat toes. Oh, man. Where am I going now? Am I going home now? And we're home! Oh my god, I just crashed into the wall. Dude, this is a, the darkest neighborhood ever. We need some more lights. I can't even see the house across the street. Alright, let's get inside. Based on a recurring childhood nightmare. Okay. That's enough TV for tonight. I gotta eat him. Jorley's, Jordan's, damn it. Jordan's Jolly Jipper. I didn't die, so they must be good. Well, I might as well open the boxes before heading to bed. All right, box number one, a bunch of books. Nice. Box number two. Ugly clothes. Damn! Why you just disrespect your dead friend like that? Calling his clothes ugly. Chill. Oh? A game? I should give it a try on my computer. Alright, got the game. And in the last box, posters. Alright, let's put this game on. Use arrow keys to move, uh, enter to select or interact. Fourth world. Yeah, I just want to look at the credits. Tom Thomas. So a solo game by Tom Thomas. Hey guys, it's me. Hey, who's that? Hello. You have a choice. What? Okay. Is it me or the- No, the game's definitely getting darker, right? No, oh, I don't like the way this guy looks. What's going on, man? Don't continue down this path. I'm gonna continue. Nah, this just took a whole turn. I'm playing a pixelated game and that face is very high res and very realistic. Why is that your first thought? Was Smash. Hello? I can't even interact with him. Beware of the man in the coat. Kinda looks like you're wearing a coat. That looks like a man in a coat. Hey, sir. What's going on? Whoa, breaking. Break the fucking computer. He has broken through. Um... Objective, exit your room? This is not my house. The door shut behind you. What is going on?
The game has just begun. Wait, did we like trade places with the thing in the game? Is that what happened? Is that how our friend died or got lost? Did he get like sucked into the game? Finish four of his levels or undergo a fate worse than death. To finish a level, locate the door. Okay, easy. Beware of the entities. All right, and it just forced me to go into level one. Sure. As I crossed the bridge, I had tears in my eyes, and I simply imagined myself diving into the water and drowning myself. Tom Thomas. That's a quote by the person who made the game. Homie was a little depressed. The head bobbing is smooth. What do you mean by that? All right. And now we're presented with a bridge. Level one, the bridge. Would the objective be, there's no way that we're just crossing this bridge. So is the objective to go into the water instead? I can't see anything. Anybody here? Okay, we got a boat. I'll just keep going. I'm not hacker, what's going on? Um Pass with care. What does that mean? No way, dude. That rain is that loud. Can you hear that? It's raining that hard. The rain is like pelting my air conditioner. I'm sorry. This goes for people on YouTube as well. Um, it is raining and uh, it is absolutely pelting my window and air conditioner. So you might be able to hear it on the mic. Okay. What is this? Ooh, it's like one of those things you could look through. Oh, wow. <laughs> what the f All right, then. That is not what I expected to see. Hello? Could have sworn I just heard someone drowning. Dude, I keep feeling like I'm seeing things in the... Ah. No, 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 no. I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that. Oh, oh, hi. Oh, that's... That's not cool at all. What is going on, dude? Oh, wait, I see trees. Does that mean that we're getting close to land? Jump? That's a big jump. Oh, damn, okay. Apparently I'm in the Olympics. I would never have been able to make that. God damn. Hey, that was a six block Minecraft jump. Are you kidding? That should not have been possible. All right. Oh, wait. Oh, it's land. And this is the door? Enter.
All right, level one done. Door number two. Sometimes I wish I could just close my eyes and then be in a better place when I open them again. Dude, where the hell did my friend get this game? There's no way they sold this in stores. Yeah, Tom Tom is really going through it. Oh no. What is going on here? Okay, we're in a room with lots of colors. I don't like my view distance. Okay. You guys understand the puzzle? Red, green, blue, yellow. Red, green, blue, yellow. We need to count how many of each circle there are. Red, green, blue, yellow. So, for red, we have one, two, two red, two, three red, three red. Okay, for blue, we have one, two, three, four, four. Four blue. Three red, four blue. Now for green... I don't know. This is where you guys come in. J count the green and the yellow for me, please. <laughs> okay. Good job, chat. Level two, the staircase. I don't like the way this is going. This reminds me of that one SCP game. Close them immediately when you see him. Left click to close your eyes? Oh wow, that's interesting. Garbage can. <laughs> I just close my eyes at the garbage. It said, it said, uh, close my eyes when I see it. I hear it, I don't see it. What is this? Missing poster. I don't like the eyes on it. Yeah, no, I think the staircase is infinite. Alright then. Oh, what the hell? Did you, did it send me back up a few floors? Oh no, no, never mind. That's not the same. There was not that many missing posters before. Is that our friend on the missing poster? I don't think so. But you never know. I hope we really do find out what happened to our friend. Like, if he did die on a level, what level did he die on? Stuff like that. But obviously, he definitely died on this game. That was cool. Oh, don't let them through. Huh? Oh, shit. Wait, close the door. Okay, it's the it's it's all the sins. Nah, I'm too fast for this, bro. You ain't got this. I got this. I'm too quick. You ain't got nothing on me. Yeah. Yeah, I'm too good. I know. I know. Oh, 
Ooh, the exit door. And done. All right, level two done. Two more left. And then I think we we are able to escape. When me and my wife got divorced, I could still feel myself crawling after her and the darkness crawling after me. Wow. All right then, Thomas. I mean, I guess making a game out of his depression, you know, is a good idea. It's a good way to get your feelings out. But at the same time, there's like limits to it. All right, I, I, they just dropped me in like a vent. Ooh, why do I walk like that? Level three, the vents. Oh, am I supposed to be crawling? Is that why I'm moving so slow? I don't know about this. Oh my god, kinda sus. Dude, I found an inflatable Among Us costume. And it has like the, uh, the imposter mouth and everything. I'm really debating it being it for one of the days on Halloween. Imagine pulling up to a party and you're the imposter. Oh man. Oh, hell no. No, oh, that thing's crawling fast. Press on my ass! Please, please hurry. 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 Please hurry, please hurry. I don't know what it is, but it is close. Please, please go. Please! If this is a dead end. Okay, it's not. I hear music. Happy music, happy music, happy music. Oh my god, I see it. I see it. I can see what it is. Oh Ouch. Wait, did that count? All right, I guess that counted, level four. Hey, I'm happy that you guys found that entertaining. I did not. All right, the final level. I am done. I finished the game. And now I feel much better. I feel like a different person. The man in the coat. Okay. My boy Tom got a whole new persona. He's now the man in the coat. Okay. All right, badass. Wait, 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 wait. Excuse me? What do you mean stage two? Wait, I'm confused. Level four, fourth world? Wait, why did it say stage two? Hi. We are all as human as you are. You're our only hope to save us all. Tom Thomas has been corrupted by the entity, including his game. The entity transformed his creation into an endless loop in which Tom Thomas relives his darkest times in life over and over again through each level. 
The entity feeds off torturing the innocent by luring people into this corrupted game. But if you bring Tom Thomas back, you bring all of us back. So I might be able to save my friend? Barney Gray, missing since January 5th, 1992. I think we're about to get a bunch of orbs, so I'm gonna turn off my webcam so we can look at all of them, because I want you guys to be able to see the faces. Inspect orb. Carlos Bull, missing since September 12th, 1993. Last seen buying a game. Damn. Dave Owens, missing since 3rd of May, 1994, last seen in his bedroom. Nah, the photos are super creepy though. Oh, this orb's big. Could it be? No. Leah Williams, missing since March 2nd, 1995. Last seen playing a game by a lake. That's our friend. Oh shit, scared me, bro. Many people who have gone missing have actually just ended up here. Do you know anything about Leah Williams? Ah, uh, yes, he is the one who has gotten the farthest in the game out of all of us. Are you too close by any chance? He was my best friend. He went missing seven years ago, and we all thought he was dead by now. Well, in that case, I could help you catch up to him. There's a glitch on this map that will spawn a door. This door will send you back to your reality for a very short amount of time. If you manage to make it to the same place where Leo was taken into the game, you will end up at the same level as Leo when the man in the coat brings you back into the game. To do the glitch, all you need to do is spam the spacebar when you're a bit further out. Also, be cautious when you're back in your own reality. The man in the coat might try to kill you for breaking the rules. Good luck. Okay, so, if we do this glitch, we'll be sent back to reality, and then we'll need to go to Leo's house to where he started the game himself. Or no, we need to go to the lake, right? It said he was playing a game by the lake. So we'll need to go to wherever he started the game, and then once we're back in the game, we will be on the same level as him. So we'll be able to see him again. All right, it said walk further out and spam spacebar. All right, and... Okay, we're back. All right, exiting the house. Drive to Leo's last known location. We're going to save our friend. I'm going to save Leo. 911 meters, Jesus. Damn, why is my car moving like trash now? Keep your eyes on the road. Or what? Probably gonna have to dodge stuff, aren't I? Oh, Jesus! Okay. Wow. Okay, we're moving- oh, we were moving a bit faster for a second there. That's a big spike. So, is this real? Like, do- would other people see this? Or is this like- I'm so confused. Maybe only I can see it. Because I played the game. We high right now? That's the plot twist. My main character never actually played anything. He just got high. And now this is what's happening. Those damn Jolly Jeepers! Oh my god. The Jolly Jeepers is what it is what did it. We gotta make it to Leo. We gotta make it to him. 
I won't let my friend die. Okay, Leo's computer's just sitting here. Oh, here we go. Yeah, I guess they, they made it make sense if he was playing on his laptop. I was confused how he was playing a game by the lake, but if he was on his laptop, then it makes sense. Console, player two joined level. So Leo's still playing? We're underwater. Oh. Leo? I'm here, man. It's been seven years, but I found you. Leo? 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 Please help me, Evan. I'm coming. I'm gonna save you. God damn, flashbang. The man in the coat. Final level. Oh, I'm gonna clap this dude so quick once I find out how to beat him. Oh my god! An unknown force is holding him back. Unknown error. Can I do something with this? Oh wait, there's something over here. What are these? Save the corrupted souls to save Thomas. To save Thomas? I mean, I guess so. Oh, is that it? Uh, level 32, Despair. Oh, so we're going to find each person's soul. I see. Barney, where you at, man? I'm, gonna, I'm following this stripe on the ground. I feel like this makes sense to be the right way. Barney, I'm here to get you out. <gasps> Barney! Why should I even try to progress anymore? I'm just going to end up dead in another level. No. I can help you if you help me. I don't need any fucking help. I'm fine with staying here. I can get you home. Home? Yes. I just need you. I need you to trust me. Do you trust me? I trust you. Let's fucking go, Barney. This is this is getting kind of emotional, I'm not gonna lie. One out of four souls saved. Level question mark question mark question mark. Dementia. Help Carlos Bull. Carlos! What's going on, homie? I feel lost. Oh sorry. <clears throat> I feel lost. Well, let's find your way home, man. What's this? Vinyl record. Oh. I remember this. Yes, sir. I used to listen to this tune all the time. Haha. <laughs> the kids always used to beg me to turn down the volume. He had kids? 
and me and the guys used to play cards while listening to this. Haha. <laughs> Come with me, man. We're gonna get you out of here. Those memories warm my soul. Two out of four souls saved. Two more, two more. Level 125, Depression. Help Dave Owens. Dave! Can you hear me, Dave? Yeah, Dave was on the grind, level 125. Let me in, Dave. Leave me alone. Hey, man, is everything alright? No. What's wrong? I don't know. I just feel so empty. I hate the feeling and I can't even explain why I'm feeling it. Hey, listen. There will always be moments in life where you feel as if nothing matters. The feeling that you'll never feel better again. And an urge to give up on everything. But I promise you, it gets better in the end. Please don't isolate yourself. I'm here for you if you'd like to talk. I'd like that, actually. You're not alone. There we go. There we go, Dave. We got you, man. We got you. Three out of four souls saved. Level Error. Grandson Safe Zone. Dude, Thomas really liked this music track, huh? Leo. Have I been forgotten, Evan? Did anyone even remember me after I disappeared? You haven't been forgotten at all. I've missed you so much, Leo. And so has everyone else. Evan? I want to go home. I'm taking you home. I am taking you home. Four out of five. They want me to save Thomas. Save Tom Thomas. Alright, we got the souls. Soul of Dave Owens. Oh, do I have to put it on here? Boom. Soul of Carlos. Soul of Barney. And finally, the soul of my friend, Leo. It's over, Tom. Thank you, Evan. You have not only saved me, but you have saved us all. I can now send all of you back to your families. Aren't you coming with us? I'm fine with staying here. You have already killed the entity so by staying here, I can live in peace. Here I can be truly happy. But now, I think it's time for you all to return home. Thank you, Evan. Alright guys, you're all going home. Missing boy found alive after seven years.
Wow. W, W. Wow, Evan is a great friend, dude. Went into the game and saved everybody. Based on Jordan's reoccurring childhood nightmare. That's so interesting. Is the nightmare that he got, like, sucked into the game? Alright. And that was broken through. That was really good. Like, that was really good. I do think, um... I kind of wish that they made some of the levels a little bit more scarier. Like, if they could have mixed some horror into the parts where we were saving the souls, I think that could have been really cool. But also, I understand why the souls parts weren't, like, scary. It was kind of showing, like, how each person had their own problems and how we were trying to help them with them. So, that makes sense. But I really did like this. I love the concept. The concept is great. And I'm actually so happy that we got a good ending. I really thought that we might find our friend's soul, but we wouldn't be able to, like, free him from the game, you know? Like, maybe he would sacrifice himself to save us and get us out of the game. But the fact that we actually got him out of the game into the real world and back with his family and the rest of the souls is actually pretty sick. That was a great game. That's a, that's a smash. 10 out of 10 for me. I love that. Actually, like, n 9 out of 10. I would have liked just a few more scares, but that's it.